Hello Scorpio, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading. It's going to be focused on your love life. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Okay, so Scorpio, what I see from these energies is an indication that many of you are thinking about this individual, right? They are on your mind. I feel like there's something about this situation that has caused you a lot of worry. You could be having a lot of anxiety and it could be around the fact that you may want to reach out to this individual, perhaps even say something. It feels like that sort of energy, like you're feeling afraid or feeling worried about how they will react. It feels like something is uh, making you want to speak to this person. You might want to see where you stand with this individual. There could be certain impulses that you've been feeling and you might want to follow that during this period of time. So that could be making things a little bit complex, but I feel like a lot of you are feeling a lot of worry in terms of uh, doing that. There could be a fear of rejection. There could be a fear that this individual will uh, not accept uh, what you have to say or that they may turn you down or not want to talk. There's definitely that indication coming up from your energy right now. There's something that's occurring inside of your energy that's wanting you to actually make that move, take that initiative, right? Some of you could be missing this individual, thinking about them. Especially if there hasn't been any communication or if it's been a situation of no contact, you might be getting to that point where you just want to, you know, connect to them or reconnect to them because of the way that things were left off in the course of the relationship. And I feel like you could be feeling that right now that you have to say something or you have to do something. Okay, so what I sense from this individual's energy is that this person is going through something as well, but it feels as if their energies is more balanced right now. It feels as if they are in a good place. I'm also picking up that their energy is grounded, okay? So what I'm sensing is that you could be dealing with an individual. The situation might might be complicated because I feel like their energy is very neutralized right now, really balanced right now. I'll have to clarify their energy. Okay, so I feel like that in this energy between you and this individual, there's this competitive energy, right? Now, this could be a complicated situation. For some of you, the individual you're dealing with might be listening to their family a lot. 
or paying attention to a certain person doing what someone requires of them or expects of them. Maybe it's a father figure or a mother figure. I feel like someone listens a lot to another individual, okay? And I'm seeing that uh, there might be competition here. There might be competition. Some sort of energy here where it feels as if you're fighting for this love. You're fighting to either be in a committed relationship with this individual or to, you know, get on the same page with this person because I feel like you see this individual as the person you want to spend the rest of your life with. But I also feel like this individual might be manipulated by someone else. There's a chance of that, okay? So let's clarify the energy. Yeah, I feel like the individual you're dealing with is afraid of consequences. It feels as if they are afraid of not listening to the individual, the other person, whomever it is. Okay, it could be anybody, right? It could be somebody that is a mother figure, father figure, it could be a sibling, it could be another person's energy that's interfering in this dynamic. But there's definitely manipulation here. And I'm picking up that... Uh, this person feels a lot of worry and grief about this. Like they don't want to upset the status quo in the situation. They don't want to make this specific person unhappy. Or maybe it's a group of individuals. It feels like that sort of energy where they don't want to shake the boat. They don't want to cause uh, difficulties, right? So the next card is giving me an indication that it's very hard to move this individual from where they are to where you want them to be because I feel like they stubbornly hold on to uh, certain things in the course of the relationship and this is something that they do uh, as a means of comfort, right? So it feels like this person that you're dealing with never likes to go against the norm, never likes to um, cause or upset the energies around them. So I feel like the person you're dealing with, um, you know, they're the type of person that could be very stubborn when it comes to this one issue. And they could be feeling stuck. They could be feeling trapped. They could be feeling like they can't make a move. And that's why the two of you have been struggling to work things out because I feel like you've been fighting for their love, but you feel as if this individual either listens to one specific person or to a group of individuals and they get manipulated in this situation it's it's feeling like manipulation i feel like they look back at what the two of you share with each other but often i feel like they try to bury themselves in their work and they don't know what to do with regard to their emotions there are times when they feel bad for not moving in regard to this connection but i also feel like they feel very helpless with regard to making a move or doing anything to turn things around okay I feel like you're missing this person and you want to reach out. Yeah. What I'm seeing from the situation is that even the prospect of initiating something with this person is very difficult for you to do, especially in terms of reaching out, giving them a call, sending them a message, sending them an email. And there's a lot of pain here. I feel like you've been hurt constantly by this individual's energy of not being there for you, not giving you the type of uh, stability that you've been craving from them. I feel like you feel let down from how they behave towards you. It feels like you know, when it comes to this connection, you've been constantly trying to get their attention, you know, make them choose you, make them value this relationship. And now if some of you were in a relationship with this individual, you know, there might be situations where there were ups and downs. And I feel like that gets used against you by someone, right? There's a possibility of that. It just feels like someone is standing in the way of this relationship 
and they're being manipulated. And this person struggles to follow their own sort of intuition, right? Yeah, and they, they get constantly disappointed time and again. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. I'm going to be looking at what you need to do in the situation. What is this individual feeling and going through when it comes to your energy? And I'm also going to be looking at how can you turn the tables in the situation so that it favors you uh, versus uh, goes against you. Okay, you can find the link in the description box below. For those of you that are in the EU or UK, if you want to purchase extended readings, you can use the same link provided below. Have a wonderful day and take care.